Apart from the default slide view, Microsoft PowerPoint offers also other views to make work with creating presentations easier. In this video we'll be exploring the outline view in Microsoft PowerPoint. The outline view is a powerful feature in PowerPoint that allows you to easily create, edit and organize text in your presentation. Whether you're creating a new presentation from scratch or editing an existing one, the outline view can save you time and help you stay organized. To access the outline view in PowerPoint, you can either click on the view tab in the ribbon and select outline view, or you can click on the outline button in the status bar at the bottom of the PowerPoint window. It is a bit confusing because if you hover your mouse over that button, you will see normal being displayed there, but clicking on that button simply toggles the view between normal and outline view. Once you are in the outline view, you will see a list of all the text in your presentation organized into a hierarchical structure based on the slide titles and bullet points. One of the main benefits of the outline view is that it allows you to easily navigate and edit the text in your presentation. You can see that each slide is a top-level note in the list and items in each slide are lower-level list items. You can navigate through your presentation by clicking on the slide titles in the left-hand pane of the outline view. You can also expand and collapse bullet points by clicking on the small triangles next to each bullet point. You can edit the text in your presentation directly in the outline view by clicking on the text and typing in your changes. You can also use the cut, copy and paste commands to move text around within your presentation. The outline view allows you to adjust the font size, color and style of the text, as well as the layout of the view itself. Here are some of the most common customizations. You can change the font of the text in the outline view by selecting it and then choosing a new font from the font group on the home tab. You can change the color of the text in the outline view by selecting it and then choosing a new color. And you can adjust the layout of the outline view by using the zoom and collapse buttons in the status bar at the bottom of the PowerPoint window. There are also some more advanced features of the outline view that can help you work more efficiently in PowerPoint. These include demoting and promoting text. You can easily demote or promote text in the outline view by selecting it and then clicking on the increase list level or decrease list level buttons in the paragraph group on the home tab. This allows you to quickly reorganize your presentation without having to manually move text around. Copying outlines. You can copy outlines from other applications. The last item has quite an interesting illustration. As some other channels have shown, you can use ChatGPT to help you creating PowerPoint presentations. Instead of creating all text yourself, you can ask ChatGPT to provide slide titles and bullet points for the slides. Of course, a presentation with only text is not very interesting, but it can be a very good base for refinement. So if you ask ChatGPT something like, Please create a list of 5 to 7 PowerPoint slides with 3 to 5 points for each slide discussing advantages of watching the Lift Your Skill channel at YouTube, omit slide and the slide number for each slide, then it will generate a text draft for your presentation. You can then copy the whole text into the outline view in PowerPoint and using the increase list level and decrease list level buttons reflect the proper layout of the presentation. that saves quite a lot of time. We hope you found this tutorial helpful and that you now are able to use the outline view to create, edit and organize your presentations more efficiently. Remember to experiment with different customizations to make the outline view work best for you. Check our other videos to learn more about various Office applications.